the curse might be coming to an end for Georgia sports teams, man. I should have rocked some of my Bulldog gear. It don't matter. Next few videos I got coming up, I'm gonna rock some Bulldog gear. Had to rock the uh, Braves championship though, cause ooh, that thing's still fresh off the press as well. The Braves championship, and now how about them dogs? After 41 years of dryness in championship, we've been in the game a couple of times, but we haven't won another championship in the same year as the Braves championship. Man, let freedom ring. Hey, you talking about man? I'm, I'm just gonna talk about it at the beginning, but man. Man, you won't believe how many backhanded compliments, underhanded compliments, left-handed compliments, and I'm left-handed, so it still got me on the neck. I ain't used to it. Everybody who's told me congratulations, everybody, probably 80% of the people said congratulations, y'all got y'all another championship, shout out to Georgia, and then about 30% of the comments or 20% are saying, yeah, y'all, congratulations. Y'all had to get us while we hurt. And I'm sure a lot of those people go by the roll tide philosophy. A lot of those people are Alabama fans who are saying that. But a lot of people hear me are saying, oh, we hurt. We this. We. It don't matter what the circumstances. This is football. Everybody hurt. That's what they say. Every time somebody win a championship of football or lose a championship of football, you always hear the coaches and the players saying, everybody hurt. Next man up. It don't matter what the circumstances was. We got that championship. We got that trophy thing. Georgia, UGA, ain't no more playing GA. Here you talking about it. Represent for the state, for the city, man. Georgia stuff, man. Here you talking about we in here, championship, two time, two time. Now, I don't know what the hell we gonna do with them Atlanta Falcons, man, but we got Atlanta Brave, and we got the Georgia, and the Hawks, they, we got Trey Young, man, so the, the, the sports is looking good in the A after all these years of struggling and striving, man. Georgia sports, Atlanta sports, we in here. That's all I'm gonna say about it. Now, let's get into the video. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, man. Rich man, what's happening with y'all today? I hope everybody, each and every one of y'all, is having a blessed day today, man. Today, man, a sneaker that uh, everybody is sleeping on, as far as I'm concerned. People are sleeping like they got some extra melatonin in their system. You feel me? But you would say that I'm sleeping on them as well. Actually, I was going to cop this shoe, but I was waiting to, for my partner to let me see the shoe in hand so I could do the review before I make a decision whether I want to buy the shoe or not. From all pictures I'm looking at on the shoe and everything, I'm thinking they dope. I'm like, did I miss something? I want to see them in hand because people are sleeping on them so hard. I'm like, I'm sure I missed something, so I got to see them in hand. By the way... The Rich Nation merch is in, as you can see. Uh, this is one of the shirts in my uh, merch. I got three shirts out right now. This is one of them with the Rich Nation on it. I have a cleanse stamp of approval shirt, and I have the buttery. Because these right here might be kind of buttery. So get you that merch. Click the link below in the description. Sorry to everybody that the shipping took a little long to get to you. But most people do have their shirts now, including me. I have my own shirt. So shout out to the shirt gang. I'll be working on some discount codes coming up. But for right now, y'all go ahead and click the link below in the description. The shop with the official Mike Rich merch on the official Mike Rich shop. You feel me? Gotta get this shirt a stamp of approval. Clank, clank, hey, you talking about? So anyway, let's go ahead and get into the sneakers without further ado. People is like hating. Like I usually don't use the word hating because I think people's opinions are people's opinions. I feel like it's a little hate on this shoe, but I could be wrong. Let's go ahead and get into it, man. The box, as you can see, my sneaker wall in the background reflecting on the box is a Nike Jordan 1 box. And it has the Soulfly uh, logo right there on the front. I think that's their logo. It gotta be, right? Because it's their shoe. Um, and it's a slide out box. Another slide out box. This is the, something that Jordan is doing. Jordan brand is doing a lot now, especially with the collabs. I'm noticing we getting a lot of these uh, plastic clear slide out boxes. Now, like I said, I haven't seen the shoe in hand yet. But um, I want to I want to get a look at it before I buy it because the resale price is not bad at all. Of course they sold out, but it's a collab and it's a Jordan, so of course it's gonna sell out. This is a size 13. It's not my size, but the box is freaking huge, man. I hope my size 12 box don't be this big, man. Um, you got Nike on that side right there. 
You got that red kind of brick or dark red, whatever you want to call it right there. And of course you got your te size tags and all that stuff. And you got kind of like this this low, y'all see the shoe, y'all y'all see the shoe. So anyway, let's go ahead and get into these, man. Official name is uh, Air Jordan 1 Retro Low OG SP. The official colorway is black, sport, red, red, and desert. This is actually a uh, sneakers app, Nike sneakers app pair right here. So let's go ahead and get into them. As you can see, like I said, Nike sneakers app pair. Nothing funny going on around here. And you see like this, like, it's like a, I don't know how to like, I want to say tiger stripe, but it's like a ripped away tiger stripe kind of print. Let's go ahead and get the shoes. Y'all been paying attention. Y'all probably know what these is by now. Ooh. 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 Rich Nation. Why is y'all sleeping on these? Matter of fact, man, hold up. Let me see what they going for. I might order my pair right. My wife want a pair of these too. Before I even show y'all the shoe, I'm finna go on GOAT. GOAT and stock it. I think goat was cheaper. I'm gonna cut it. I'm gonna cut and edit through this. One second. Yes, sir. So I just ordered mine and my wife's pair because they was going for a little bit over two hundred dollars a piece, and um, I ordered both pair. These are y'all tripping. Then they got the original swoosh. Oh man. Oh god. Oh, I didn't even notice that. <laughs> The Air Jordan 1 low, so fly. Man, I ain't even gonna lie. I'm so glad I ordered these, bruh, before the price went up. I don't know if the price gonna go up, but these are hard. Shout out my boy Zay for letting me see this pair. This is a size 13, so mine gonna look a little smaller than this, but these are crazy. I love collabs, and I love when they bring us these dope materials. As y'all know, I also j love Jordan 1 Lowe's, and there's a lot of people sleep sleeping on this sneaker. And in hand and person, this thing is pure, unadulterated butter. These are battery. Yeah, it's a battery. Yeah, you talking about? Boy, these things buttery, man. So, a couple of things. So, it's a Soul Fly shoe. I think it's based on the Florida Everglades, if I'm not mistaken. I'm, I want to look it up now. Okay, yeah, so I read that right. They are based on the carnivorous, carnivores, wildlife of the Florida Everglades. As you know, Soul Fly is in Miami. And I don't know how many times I've been in Miami, but I have not yet to visit Soul Fly yet. So, they do have a store down there, I'm pretty sure. They ain't just online, right? Am I tripping? Um, but boy, woof! One of the main things I like about this shoe, and a lot of times when they go with the collabs, I'm glad that the people who help design these shoes decide to go with the OG Jordan 1 Low. Because if you don't know, the OG Jordan 1 Low has this big swoosh. Now, you can barely see it because it's the same color as the rest of the sneaker, but it has the bigger, the fatter swoosh on the Jordan 1 Low. When you see that fatter swoosh and you see that Nike uh, Air and stuff on the tongue, you automatically know that's the original. That's the way the OG was. The one we begin lately been having the smaller swoosh, which is the swoosh that comes on the highs. This has the same swoosh as the OGs that came out years ago. Same swoosh as the Travis Scott Fragments Lows. They use that swoosh as well. As well as the oversized uh, wing logo in the back. Oof. Man, like I said, based on the, uh, the animals in the Florida Everglades, this right here kind of have like a, a ripped. It's not like, I keep thinking, I keep saying tiger stripe, but it's not tiger stripe. It's kind of a ripped. Uh, it, it, I'm sure it's meant to remind you of the animals, but it just, it's not quite tiger stripe. And it's the same thing, it's kind of reversed. On the back, it, it's just desert on desert, whatever, that's the desert is the color. And on the front, it's like black with a little desert around the toe. And that toe box is that red suede buttery. Red suede with the red suede around the side. I did not realize that this side, actually, the swoosh is fur. I did not realize that upon looking at the pictures. This swoosh is fur. I don't know if y'all can tell, but it is like straight up like cow fur, bro. That is crazy. I love, one thing I love about collabs is when they go crazy with the materials and they went crazy with the materials on these. I, I just literally just ordered my bell. The bottom has that gum bottom, that dark gum bottom going on. Very nice on the inside. You have this uh, Jordan tag right here uh it's a jordan with the jump man in the back tag fire and it has that same 
animal type Everglade mountainy type print on the inside, man. These things stupid. On the tongue, you have the OG Nike Air tongue, the white tab with the red writing, but you also have the red around the back of the tongue, kind of outlining the tongue. Can you, boy, that is hard, boy. Uh, these release, they uh, retail for $150. You do have extra laces with this shoe right here. So uh, they retail for $150. I paid like two, 203, 208, or something like that on StockX for me and my wife's pairs. These are the laces that the shoe comes with. You have that same pattern on this black lace, that Everglade looking pattern. And you have this um, kind of like desert color as well. And you also have the red. Usually I would go with like the red laces or the lighter color laces. I'm definitely not going with this print because I think that'll be overkill. But I might actually keep the black in these. I think the black looking, looking pretty nice in these. If not the black, the red will look crazy. This one, this shoe actually has the Soulfly logo on the back. So that's another hint. And I'm going to tell you like this. You've seen all these little small details I didn't uh, uh, showed on this shoe. That's what I like about collabs. It ain't about height to me. It's about because these are definitely not hyped at all. People sleeping, people saying they trash can water, they don't like them and all that stuff. But I really like the shoe. I like the fact that it is a collab. And I... And because it's a collab, it always brings the best materials and all the little details that you find on the sneakers when you have the collabs going on. So anyway, that is my review right there on the Air Jordan 1 Low Soul Fly. These are fire and cleansed in my humble opinion. Clank, clank, cleanse, stamp of approval, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think about these. My pair will be on the way, my size 12. I'll probably put the unboxing at the end of a vlog or something like that. And when I get them, I'm definitely gonna spray them with my water and stain repellent from Resuvenator, man. Y'all go ahead and click the link below in the description because this stuff I figured out does work excellent on suede as well. Suede shoes, all suede. Uh, Raging Bull 5, stuff like this. This shoe is all suede. You can spray this shoe down with this Rejuvenator water and stain repellent and it will definitely protect your shoes from any dirt, mud, grime, anything like that. Anything like that, get on your sneakers while you have this stuff. Um, like I said, you gotta put on your shoe, let it dry for a few hours. And anything that fall on your shoe, drips, nasty stuff, disgustingness, dripping sink, dripping tin. Fall on your sneakers while this Rejuvenator water and stain repellent is on there. All you gotta do is rinse your shoe off with just H2O, regular water, rinse your shoe down, and it will roll right off the shoe. Um, and like I said, it works really good on suede too, which I didn't know at first I was like nervous to put it on suede, but it works really good on a suede surface as well. Like I said, click the link below in the description. You can get this rejuvenated water and stain repellent and a whole bunch of dope fire sneaker cleaning products. You automatically get 10% off your entire order by using my link below. So make sure before you order, and the way you want to order is by using my link below in the description for Rejuvenator, man. Turn your beetles back into heaters with Rejuvenator, man. Do it! And like I said, these are fire. I'm glad I ordered me and my wife a pair of these. Air Jordan 1 Low, Soul Flies. I'm really digging the lows. And I'm really digging the fact that people aren't digging the lows. Bring on more lows, Jordan brand. They're supposed to have a color way of the Air Jordan 1 low coming out later on this year that's really similar to the uh, Travis Scott low, and, but it's just a regular Jordan 1 low. But I'm really digging the collabs. People, bring on more collabs. Companies, whoever, whoever didn't do a collab with Jordan 1 lows yet, um, do a Jordan 1 low and use that OG swoosh like that, man. I love the way that shoe look. It look way better than that, that uh, real general release uh, fat. Jordan 1 low that been coming out with the 23 right here on the tongue, the one we've been getting in every colorway. This is the way I want my Jordan 1 uh, lows to look, man. Just like this. So anyway, I appreciate y'all for watching, stopping through the channel, man. Make sure you click the link below and get my uh, merch, man, because it's looking good. It's looking fire. I got some more design ideas to put on these shirts, and I, I might alter some of this stuff on different colors and stuff like that as well. I know y'all won't. Y'all don't just wear black and white shirts. So we got more merch coming. I appreciate you, everybody who bought the shirts, man. And I appreciate y'all for coming through to the channel, man. Y'all hit the thumbs up, like, subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already, hit the notification bell so you can become a part of Rich Nation. Stand all the way up to the moon on them and keep watching my video because that's what I'm here for. Gone. Yeah, 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 yeah. Rich. Mike, Rich, no hype, just kick. Jordan, six, eight, and nine, fit. How does.
nutrients Clank, clank, cleanse, bless, yes I'm rich, ill, I can't eat, you know me OG, only, real, no phony